Hello, my pals. This is Holly or Quiet Unicorn. If you want to follow me on Roblox, today we are playing Break In Story, which was recommended to me by my nephews, Job and Harvey. Thank you so much. So hello everyone, and welcome to my new home. This is my house apparently, and there are snacks hidden around that restore energy, which is actually pretty convenient because I am really snackish right now. So come with me as we explore the house. We're going to interact with some things, and oh my gosh, look, there's a couple of fans of my channel. That's so nice, I hope that they see this video. Isn't it nice that we can spend this time together opening up drawers? So I'm just doing a little bit of exploring, eating my apple here in the living room where apparently some breaking news is going to happen in just a couple of minutes. I wonder what the breaking news is gonna be. If you have any ideas about what the breaking news might be, let me know in the comment section. I think it might be breaking news, nothing in drawers. This just in, drawers remain empty. Oh, hello, what room is this? <gasps> the pink room, I love this room. Mm, this is gonna be my bed. And then um, check these drawers. Oh yeah, no, nope, empty. Nothing in any of them. Why is this house so empty? It's like there's no socks, there's no shirts, there is nothing in this bedside table. Starting to get a little bit, oh my gosh, I spoke too soon. I just found a cookie. I completely retract my previous statements. Oh, Mr. Jingle found the basement key. Mr. Jingle has unlocked the basement, but it's too dark to see inside. Well, I have found a can of soda. What do you think of that, Mr. Jingle? Is Mr. Jingle the cat? <laughs> I think that Mr. Jingle is another player, but in my heart of hearts, um, Mr. Jingle is definitely the cat. Um, okay, I'm just gonna check, make sure there aren't any more cookies hiding in any of these drawers. No, and oh, is that the basement? Ooh, it is dark. Oh, I don't like it down here. Oh, how do I get out? It's, 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 well, okay, okay, we're out, and um, I'm just gonna leave the basement alone for now. I, I feel like that's no place for me. Ooh, it's Weenie has found a locked vault behind one of the paintings? The code is somewhere in the basement. Wow, and breaking news in two minutes. This house has a lot going on. We've got a creepy basement, we've got a secret vault behind a painting, and we've got a breaking news event. Oh, something's happening. Hello, am I in the basement? Oh, nope, we're good. Okay, something's happening. Take a seat at the table. Dinner will be here soon. Oh my gosh, did someone order dinner? That is so exciting. What did we get? I hope it is dumplings. Um, oh, <laughs> the table's <laughs> too high for most of us. Our like little heads are just like barely poking over the side of the table. <laughs> it looks really funny. Um, okay, what are we having for dinner, everybody? Look, they can like barely reach. <laughs> we need booster seats. Come on, everyone, sit down. Mr. Jingles, you too. Everyone get in here, dinner is gonna be here soon. And everyone has to get to the table. So what did we order? I am personally hoping for some crispy dumplings because, of... what was that? Someone is at the door. Do we answer it? Um, are we, are we gonna answer it? Do... Oh, Mr. Jingle opened the door. No, Mr. Jingle. <gasps> oh, it's the pizza delivery man. Oh! That was so dramatic. A tip for you. Wow, and look at all the pizzas on the table. Okay, I admit that I was a little bit scared when I heard the knock at the door, but now that I've got two slices of pizza, all is forgiven. I mean, who can be upset when they have two pieces of pizza in their hands and like my energy is just skyrocketing, so I think I'm gonna be fine. Hey, now that we finished dinner, what do you think about that breaking news event? Do we think that that's gonna, oh, oh my gosh, what's happening? I think there was some sort of power outage or something. What happened to the lights? But look, the lights are still on in, in one of the rooms. Lights are still on in the living room. The television is still running. Okay, everybody, quick, get in here to the cinema. Uh, oh, breaking news in 17 seconds. This is really strange. And oh, that looks like the vault. That's weird. Okay. 10 seconds and then hopefully we are gonna find out what is going on here. I wanna get to the bottom of this. This is not how I expected to be spending my first night in my new home. Oh, here we go. Breaking news. Give it to me, give it to me straight. <gasps> An emergency broadcast? Oh, that doesn't sound good. This is not good. a drill, I repeat. This is not a drill. The purge has begun. Villains are on the loose and should be avoided. Do not engage them, or you may be injured or killed. Games are being invaded and destroyed. I repeat that this is not a drill. Stay- What just happened? Did the broadcast get interrupted? 
Hmm. Okay. This is unusual. Uh, hopefully, nothing to worry about. What do you mean, nothing to worry about? Look at their leader, Scary Larry. He's very scary. It's bedtime. Sleeping gives you energy. Go to bed. All right, I am going to go upstairs and go to bed, but I have a very bad, bad feeling about what is going on here. Okay, I'm just going to hop into my bed in the pink room and get some energy, and hopefully the purge will not start while I'm asleep. And anyway, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. It's fun. So I kind of feel like that emergency broadcast um, didn't give me as much information as I really needed. Something called The Purge is happening. There is a leader called Scary Larry. Um, everybody has kind of freaky masks. Um, and that's basically all the information I've got, other than that I need to keep the windows and doors. Oh my gosh! <gasps> what just happened? Oh! Uh, hello? Oh my gosh! Oh no! 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 Oh my gosh, did they just break into my window? <laughs> the game's like, you can't sleep right now. It's like, yeah, I wouldn't want to. Where am I supposed to go? No. Where am I supposed to go? How do I get out of here? Please. Where's the door? Oh, what just happened? Oh, I cannot heal. You cannot heal yourself. I don't make the rules. What just happened? It's daytime now? Did I survive? Oh. <gasps> The blue room was attacked last night. Everyone survived, but I was in the pink room. What happened to the pink room? The pink room was attacked last night. Everyone survived. Cool. Okay, so I'm not dead. Huge news, everyone. I am still in the land of the living. Uh-oh. They're coming for us. We cannot let another attack happen. There are boards in the main room. Board up every window and door. Okay, I'm gonna start with this one because that is definitely where they came through. Smash the glass up and everything, very rude. Um, okay, I need some more boards. Um, let's just board up. You guys doing this one? Here, I can help. Oh, no, <laughs> or maybe I'll just have a little nap. I'm gonna board up this window. There's no getting through here, okay? We are not gonna be attacking the pink room anymore. Hey, did anybody notice that there's a trap door? Ooh, it's too high to enter, but maybe there's a ladder somewhere. <gasps> I've got a great idea. What if we could hide in the attic? And then maybe when Scary Larry or whoever else comes and tries to bash down the windows, they'll be like, oh, an abandoned house with nobody in it. Hey, what's this? It's weird, there's like a laptop there. Um, but yeah, so if we can find a ladder, maybe we can go up to the attic, up in there. And maybe that's somewhere that we can hide. I don't know. Just an idea. I'm just spitballing here. Just trying to throw ideas out. You know, there's a purge happening. It's like, obviously, we do have the option to hide in the terrifying basement as well. But, um, you know, I'm not advocating for that. <laughs> I think the attic, um, sight unseen, uh, is better. Better than the scary, scary basement. Maybe we should just, like, block off the basement. <laughs> Actually, that's actually a good idea because like maybe they could come in through the basement. So we should probably block off the basement door too. Um, okay, so let's see if there is anything, any more boards that we could do. Oh, let's see what they, what they said. You did a perfect job at protecting the house. This should hold them back very well. Well, thank you, voice of the house. Mr. Jingle and It's Weenie did the most to protect the house. Oh, well, that's that's good. Thank you for doing that. I also tried, but that's fine. Something's happening. Okay. What is it? Wow. It got late fast. Yeah, time flies when you're boarding up all of the uh, doors and windows. There are three pieces of pizza left over, and they will be given to the three people sitting at the table in 20, 19. I got to the table first. I don't know if you noticed. What if we just cut the pieces of pizza in half and then everybody I think can get a half? Good idea? Good idea. So we're just like waiting here, eh? Nothing. Oh my gosh, those pizzas, they spun like ghost pizzas. And hey, they weren't at the table first. We were at the table first. This is an injustice. Oh my gosh, okay, lights are off again. Forget about the pizza. I don't care about the pizza. Oh my gosh, no. I think the purge is happening again. Where is that light coming from? I think it's coming from outside. I'm gonna run away from it though. I think it's um, kind of scary to me. I think I might just hide in the darkness with my friends. Oh. <gasps> they're outside. Oh no, they're there. We have to hope the boards will be enough to hold them back. Okay, well I'm standing in front of a window that looks pretty unboarded. So count me out of the blue room. 
Okay, we gotta go to our rooms and go to bed and protect our friends. Okay, this is my bed. Where are my friends? There's no one here to protect me. Oh no, maybe I should have stayed in the blue room, but the blue room did look pretty unsafe. So I guess I'll just lay here dreaming about using my star code unicorn until something happens. Maybe they're gone. Maybe they saw our boarded up windows and thought, oh, nope, that sounds like they have um, broken through our defenses. Oh no, oh no, there's an attack happening out there. I need to help my friends. Why can't I exit the room? Oh no, oh no. Oh, there's something bad happening on the other side of that wall. Um, but I am trapped. So just gonna chill at my desk and no, I just, I need to get to my friends. So what is wrong with these doors? You shouldn't have doors that lock at night in the middle of a purge. All right, get, t tell it to me straight, what happened? Okay, it's morning. Open the door. <laughs> Let me out. Okay, the blue room was attacked last night, but everyone survived. Well done, everybody. Yeah, and the green room was attacked last night, but everyone survived. Wow, we are a bunch of survivors. The boards weren't enough to hold them, but thankfully they retreated. Anyone need some healing? I got some healing. Oh, let me heal you. Oh, I've healed Mr. Jingle. I didn't know that was Mr. Jingle. <gasps> What's happening down here? Head downstairs and check on the windows and doors. Be careful. It's me has discovered a broken window. Oh my gosh, maybe they did come through the basement. The basement door has been left open. I think, I think a bad guy is still down there. Of course they are. Of course they are. Uh, they sound huge. Okay, quick, hide in the kitchen or living room closets. Uh, okay, I will hide in closet. Oh, I'm hiding behind, <laughs> hiding behind the drawers. <laughs> Me and my friends just hiding behind this dresser. Oh, whoa, oh, whoa. Oh my gosh, is that who I think it is? Okay, don't want to alarm anyone, but I think that might be Scary Larry. Okay, try to be very small. Try to be small. Smaller if possible. Okay, then surely they won't see our forehead sticking out from behind the dresser. Oh, no, there he is. Oh, it's Scary Larry. He's so scary with his beard and his purple jacket. Freaky. Okay. Where's he going? Oh, he's going upstairs. Ooh, he's got like a little wind-up thing in his back. That is creepy. Don't love that at all. <laughs> okay, everyone's jumping out from behind our hiding spots. So, he's gone upstairs. Quick, run to the basement. But how are we supposed to see what's going on down there? Oh, someone's turned on the lights. Okay, thank goodness. We can finally see what's going on down here. Okay, what do we do? Ooh, a snack, love a snack. Um, yum, 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 yum. What else have we got? What's in any of these? Oh, a ladder! Oh, the ladder is draining my energy. Okay, drop that. I will come back for that later. We can do that whole attic situation later. Now we've got to deal with Scary Larry. More snackies. Yum, yum. Love that Mr. Jingle, um, which is what I will continue to call the cat, um, has come downstairs with us. Thank you so much. Uh, oh no! You left the basement door open! This is gonna be a lot harder. Now, can we just go close it? Can we go close it right now? I've got a hammer and hammer it closed. Okay, I've got a hammer. Oh no, what's that noise? My friend has a bat. What's happening? They're trying to break in! Defend the basement! Uh, oh my gosh, why are we even in the basement? This is ridiculous. Okay, you know what? We are going to defend our territory. Oh my gosh! You scared the living socks out of me. I'm gonna get you for that. Oh, where? Oh, no, no. <laughs> Looks like we took them down. <gasps> and I think that somebody's got the code to the vault. Oh my gosh, we are making some serious progress here. All right, we have defended the basement. Thank you, Mr. Jingles. Oh my gosh, there's another one. All right. Um, you disrupted my sleep, and I hate it when that happens. Cool, we got them. Haha. <laughs> Teaching these villains a lesson, aren't we, Mr. Jingles? Mr. Jingles, are we teaching them a lesson? Yeah, he loves it. Oh no, it looks like we've got some more, some more uh, battle happening over here. I'm ready to heal anyone, if anyone needs a bit of a heal. Oh, can't heal yourself, but I can heal some other people. Wow, wow, we're good. Can I heal anyone else? Yeah, 
Boom. You like being healed? <gasps> Mr. Jingle has located a dropped padlock. This should hold them off for now. Well, thank goodness. So, like, what's the plan here? We're gonna put the padlock on the door. Um, okay, so we're gonna have to spend the night down here. Luckily, everyone seems to have brought sleeping bags. Um, there are three bedrolls in the basement, but there's only some of you will be able to sleep tonight? Oh no, I just found a pile of cash. It's pretty cool. Give the beds to whoever needs them the most. It's gonna be a very cold night. Why can't we snuggle? I feel like there's room for all of us on these beds. What if we push the beds together and then it's like one big bed? Hey. Oh, oh no, I don't get to sleep tonight. All right, it is gonna be a long night. I'm on sentry duty. Me and Mr. Jingles. Mr. Jingles, if you see any villains, say meow. Okay, that's our secret code. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, is it morning? I think it might be morning. <gasps> we survived the night. It was pretty chilly, and I am absolutely exhausted. Um, but if anyone wants to give me an apple, that might be nice. All right, so we are heading out of the basement. The, I guess that those villains must only attack at nighttime, um, which is, I guess, very villain behavior. The front door was broken open. That must be how they left it. Oh my gosh. And we've completely run out of supplies. <gasps> and look at the town. Head out the door and find the grocery store, or what's left of the grocery store, more like it. They have destroyed my whole neighborhood. What, why? Why are they doing this? Yeah, the neighborhood is destroyed and there's ice all over the road. So we gotta be really, really careful uh, not to slip on the ice. Um, but I mean, for now, looks like we might do a little bit of looting. Oh, oh, just kidding. I bought a cookie for $20. <laughs> Here I was thinking I would get to do a bit of looting, but there's nothing on the shelves and that is just, so oh, my, ow, oh my gosh. I just hoit myself. Okay, everyone really be careful on that ice. They are not kidding when they say that you could hurt yourself. Um, just stay away from it, if at all possible. Um, whoa. I am really freaked out by how destroyed the whole town is. Hello, sir, do you know what happened? Oh. <laughs> Sorry. I need to bump into you like that. Um, oh, look at my house. I just moved in today and all of the windows are broken. Do you know what happened? Do you know what mm -hmm. happened here? Crazy Uncle Pete? Uncle Pete wants one cookie, one cookie, and one cookie pie. I mean, don't we all, Crazy Uncle Pete? You're not the only one who wants one cookie, one cookie, and one cookie pie. Um, I wonder what Crazy Uncle Pete would do for us if we gave him one cookie, one cookie, and one cookie pie. It's, it's a mystery. Oh my gosh, it's Weenie, open the safe. And there is a pile of money inside. Oh my gosh, a pile of money. Can I have some of the money? I am but a poor girl with only $10 to my name. And I spent $20 on a cookie not long ago. And it was not a wise purchase, but I was very hungry. And I love cookies and cookie pies. Um, oh, something's happening. It is getting late again get home before we lock the doors for the night we haven't done any more boarding <gasps> are we all at a boards oh no this is gonna be a rough night where are we supposed to spend the night it's like we could go up to the bedrooms we could go back to the basement oh put cookie in pie oh oh i don't have a cookie i ate my cookie oh maybe they want to give it to crazy uncle pete i'm so sorry i don't have a cookie to contribute maybe you can use some of that money from the safe, buy all the cookies. Oh no, everyone, it's already nighttime and our defenses are severely weakened. I don't know how we're gonna survive the night, but we're gonna have to try because I do not want to get purged. Oh, good job grabbing supplies at the grocery store. I think we'll order pizza for dinner. <laughs> oh my gosh, the pizza will be here soon. Yum, is that a cookie pie? Ooh, take a seat at the table. Um, Cool, all right, take a seat at the table. I can't believe that we can order pizza in the middle of an apocalypse. Oh, Mr. Jingle baked a delicious cookie pie and it's on the dining room table. Oh wow, it is, it looks so good. Thank you so much, Mr. Jingle. Um, both a talented, talented baker and a cat. It's incredible. Um, can I have a piece of the cookie pie? Oh my gosh. Oh, did I just take all the cookie pie? 
Oh, that's a bit embarrassing. I think I just accidentally took three slices of cookie pie. Um, someone's at the door. Should we answer it? It's probably the pizza. Although... <gasps> Mr. Jingle opened the door. Is that the pizza? But what happened to his face? Here's his face. I'm scared. It's gonna be scary. Oh, no! We've been tricked! It wasn't a pizza delivery at all! Uh-oh. Yeah, that's right. We have just opened the door to the... Wait, did we get pizza? So, wait. He actually brought us pizza? <laughs> oh, no! Get him! Defeat the pizza guy! I've got a hammer, and you only have a roller. Oh, my gosh. Okay, he is uh, pretty powerful. He's our most formidable enemy yet, and he's pirouetting up the stairs. What is he doing? <laughs> get him! If we get him here, he can't spin. Get him before he can spin. Oh, no, he's going to back into spinning. Oh, no, he's spinning. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Okay, I'm just trying to heal some people. Heal, heal, heal. I'm on the sidelines doing some healing. Okay, now let's really take them out. Yeah, you make great pizza, but we hate it when you break into our house. Oh. <laughs> okay, I think he is. I think he's done. I'm gonna try to heal some people. Healy, healy. Where's money? Heal. There we go. Gotcha. Um, okay, so. Good job, everyone. It's time to go to bed. What about the pizza? Okay. Actually, no, it's big day tomorrow. We're going to escape the house tomorrow. Um, so we need to be well rested. Um, cool. So, you know, I'm sure it will be easy to sleep given the current circumstances. I'm going to sleep in the green room tonight because at least I've got a buddy in here. I'm tired of being in the pink room all by myself. And then it's like things go sideways. I'm the only one there. Um, so at least tonight I will have some company. All right. Large hand. Let's protect each other. I didn't actually get a chance to sleep last night, so I'm gonna have like a real big snooze. But you know, if anyone breaks in, just like wake me up. Um, sometimes I can be a little bit hard to wake up in the morning. So you could bring me like a coffee. Um, just like put it next to the side of my bed and I'll be I'll be up in no time. Uh, oh, uh, uh oh. Um, Lord Chan, Lord Chan, oh. There is something happening in the next room. I think that the blue room's being attacked again. I'm gonna eat some cookie pie. Yeah, just a bit of cookie pie. Take my mind off things, Larchan. Larchan's still sleeping. Okay, that's cool. I mean, you you are you sleep away, Larchan. You get those Z's. Okay, I think the night is over. Let's find out what happened. Larchan, you good? I thought I was the heavy sleeper, but Larchan is just snoozing. The blue room was attacked last night, but everyone survived. Yeah, we're survivors. Um, but an alarm is going off. Does anyone know what the alarm is? Okay. We're gonna check it out, but we gotta be really, really careful. Okay. Should we go outside? How do we open the door? <laughs> I think everyone's just like waiting for the door to open. <gasps> oh no, what's happening? Whoa, something's happening at the Blocky Mart. Who's that? Oh, it's Scary Larry! Our old pal. Okay, Scary Larry is coming this way. We need to escape now! Right now! Find the sewer! I'm sure we'll be safe down there. Yeah, everyone knows that. The safest place to be is in the sewer. Probably. Um, okay, maybe the entrance to the sewer is down here. We got a little sewer entrance. What if I flush myself down the toilet? Do you think that that will work? Will I be safe then? Mm, let's run across some broken glass. Um, where are my friends? Does anyone know how to get to the sewer? Oh, I think I see it. <gasps> is that the sewer? It's the sewer! Okay, he's coming this way. I can hear him with his big, boomy steps, but let's hop in the sewer. Cool, all right. Cool. So, now I'm in the sewer. <laughs> wow, it really stinks down here. Oh, I'm getting splashed with sewage. Okay, at least I've got my pals. The sewer is flooded. Yeah. Yeah, it's a sewer. So, this is probably just normal op operations down here. The oh my gosh, the sewer has been drained. Continue down the path. Wow. That is so lucky. Uh, but it will flood again soon. So, um, let's hurry, because I don't want to be, um, completely engulfed 
by stinking sewage. <gasps> oh no! Quickly! Mr. Jingle is drowning! Miss oh no! Someone else is drowning! My friends are drowning! Oh no! Oh, oh, some people saved each other from drowning! <gasps> Teamwork! We love it! Well done! Okay, I can heal you. Come here. I'll heal you. Stop moving. Yeah, there we go. I healed you, Mr. Jingle. Uh, oh my gosh, I just realized we've left other Mr. Jingle behind! Mr. Jingle the cat. Where could he be? Okay, hopefully, Scary Larry has no interest in Mr. Jingle the cat. Um, hopefully, we'll be fine. Uh-oh, error, player scripts. Dialogue service 48, error. Error, error. Rebooting. Was that on purpose? <laughs> Don't know if that was part of the game or not. Uh-oh, reboot failed. Unsanctioned. Stuff happening. Error, error. Is this part of the game or, oh my gosh, the lights are going off. Uh, okay. Error, error. Error, error. Uh. Oh no! <gasps> it's scary. Larry, run! Run, or should we try to fight him? Should we try to defeat him? He's looking pretty scary. Is he gonna spin? Oh. Whoa. <gasps> what happened? Hello. My name is Scary Larry. Oh, there he is up on his little platform. And up until now, you've been playing easy mode. Luckily for you, that's about to change. All right. Time to die. Oh, Scary Larry, you're so dramatic. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Minions rise. It's time for the purge. Ooh, they're rising, but I have a hammer. And I'm going to use it on these folks. Oh, the ooh, I don't like the noises. <laughs> it's very, like, bone crunchy. Um, okay, so we're going to have to get all of the... Oh, my gosh, it's Scary Larry. Here he comes. Where is he going? Time to handle you myself. Oh my gosh, is that really all of your minions? That is so embarrassing. You've got like hardly any minions. Okay. So the red stripes need to show us which direction Scary Larry is heading in next. So we just gotta figure out a way to defeat him. Oh, stay out of there. Can't even figure out how to smack him. Hmm, all right. He's a bit scary. Here's the thing. I think that we need to sit down with Scary Larry. We need to go like, Scary Larry, come over here. I'm going to make you a cup of tea. We're going to have a big chat. I need to know, why must you be so scary? Okay, I'm just going to... Oh, try turning the key on his back. Ooh, maybe we can disable him. I'm going to get that key on your back. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, he's jumping. Oh, he's back up on his platform. Oh, and he's going to try to summon some more... Minions, what's a rose without some thorns? He is so dramatic. Oh, no! Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is very scary. Oh. hate this. Oh, no, someone's drowning. Ah! 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 Okay. Larry, why are you doing this? Oh, I gotta get them. Get my friend. How do I save them from drowning? Oh no! How do I save them from drowning? Someone help! Scary Larry, why are you doing this? You're making me extremely angry. Uh, uh, okay. Here's the thing though. You're kind of the one attacking us. Um, so I kind of feel like you're the one making me extremely angry and I am gonna try to turn that key on your back. Get out of the way. Just gotta wait for you to stop spinning. But he loves spinning. It's his favorite thing. Like a ballet dancer. I need to understand why he's doing this though. Like, what is the purpose of the perch? Why are you so angry at us? Like, we just met today. Like, you can't possibly have a grudging. Oh my god, get the get the key, get the key, get the key, get the key. <gasps> yes, yes. I think I've done something. He's spinning. Oh, ooh. Okay, I don't know if that actually did anything. Oh, no, he's back on his platform. It's bad news when he gets back up on the platform. <laughs> What's it gonna be now? Minions, rise! It's time to purge. 
All right, a couple more minions. That's fine. We can totally take care of these guys. Oh no, there's another one waiting with a crowbar. But I'm gonna get ya. You're backed into a corner, and I'm gonna get ya. Cool. All right, well done. Cool. Oh no, he's back. Okay. He's only got one heart left, though. You're making me extremely angry. And when Scary Larry gets angry, he spins and he dances and he frolics. Scary Larry dancing is a great way to work through your anger and maybe you could consider that instead of the purge. I'm just throwing out ideas. Oh. Look, he's only got one heart left and I think that we are so close to defeating him. All we have to do is get him the as soon as he stops spinning. Okay, just like... I'm just gonna hang out on the side here, and as soon as he stops spinning, I am gonna go in for the kill. He stopped. It's my chance! I'm gonna get you to Yes! <gasps> you are defeated, Scary Larry. Yeah, you like that? Not so scary now with your beard falling off. And his golden crowbar of power. Oh, wait a second. You. You did it! Wow, even the narrator is surprised. Yeah, Scary Larry has been defeated, and it was me who dealt the final blow. Pretty proud of myself. Um, oh, I don't have enough energy to use this. Interesting. Does anyone want to pick up the um, sparkly golden um, crowbar of power? Um, oh, I think I'm a little bit worried that Scary Larry's body is like moving a bit. What if that golden crowbar of power can bring him back to life? I think we need to be really, really careful. Can someone pick it up? Or at least, like, kick it away from his dismembered body? That would be good. Uh, okay, so we're just gonna hang out down here in the sewer, is he? Is that our plan? We're just gonna hang out in the sewer with Scary Larry. Oh, dang. Okay, just look to the chat. Um, someone says, don't pick it up. I think they're talking about the golden crowbar. Um, I was wrong. Uh, I trust this person. Do not pick it up. Hmm, some stuff that I can buy in here. Oh, maybe I'll get a treaty for my pals. Yeah, let's heal everyone. Yeah, that'd be cool. We love it when everybody's healed. Okay, cool. Yeah. You like that, everyone? Yes, I healed everyone to full HP. My gift to you. Just in case he comes back to life, because I'm a little bit scared. I've just got this awful feeling that maybe something bad is going to happen, because it's like, look, it's twitching. His body is twitching. It's scary. Stay away from the crowbar. <laughs> Uh, and it's also like nothing's really happening and I'm like, why are we just like hanging out down here in the sewer if, you know, if something additionally scary is not gonna happen? Um, I think his body's trying to put itself back together. I think it's putting itself back together! Uh, don't mean to alarm anyone, but I feel, I, I have a really, really bad feeling about this. What are we supposed to do? I could like hit it more with my hammer. Okay. Um, Mr. Jingle says, what is happening? And that is a very legitimate question. What is happening here? I mean, we could just like leave the sewer. I'm kind of feeling like maybe we should leave. Oh, his hand just moved. Hate that. I'm starting to think that we should just leave the sewer. Okay, so let's put it to a vote. Um, everyone on team get, um, out of the sewer. Ooh, hello. There we go. Someone just lowered a ladder. It looks safe to climb. Okay, I guess we all wanted to be on team get out of this stinky sewer. Uh, let's get to the surface and then we can, you know, digest what has happened here tonight. Because this has been a long few days in the purge. <gasps> we win. Good ending. Congratulations. I hope you enjoyed the game. Oh, look, now they're all crying from behind their mess. Yeah, that's what happens when you terrorize innocent people. Uh, you get defeated by me, my hammer, and the true hero of this story, Mr. Jingles the Cat.